This is my outdoor aquaponic system. About two and a half months running now. Simply made out of an IBC tote with a few cheap components. It is doing extremely well. These are some elephant ears which I took out of my yard because they weren't doing so well. Put them in here and now they're doing great. There are two of them. Got quite a few jalapeno plants in here. Habanero. Gypsy peppers. Sweet basil. Rose moss that I just stuck in. Some sky basil. That's a tomato plant that I started in here from seed. It's doing very well. I've got some marigolds growing in here just to keep bugs out. Doing extremely well. Some ochre plants, which are getting climbed on by my other vining plants. This is the big top basil, which I have taken the grass off of, clone. I've got some cucumbers. It's growing all over the place, it's growing up into my honeysuckles. Then I've got some cantaloupes, which are climbing up and up and up. They've got quite a few blooms on them. have got quite a few young cantaloupe getting started. Not bad for two and a half months. All this flows from the pond, from the pump, comes down here, goes up, forced off this way, just aerate my water. Comes uh, this way and goes into the back back here where there's a bucket where my biofilter is. And that's where I clone my plants. I stick them in those white PVC pipes, get rid of and then I transfer them into the grow beds. Off the other side of that bucket, it comes out and across here where I have this outlet to kind of flush out the bat the heavy debris that gathers in the bottom. I've got this sock on here to catch the debris so I can use this fertilizer in my garden. Some more marigolds down there. The cantaloupe are growing all through this bush, way up in there. I have a few mud cat, about 20. There's a catfish eating a dead minnow that I just threw in here. I've got an algae eater to kind of help keep the sides clean. I've got about Oh, a hundred or so bullhead minnows swimming around in here, which was a whole lot more, but they're getting eat up by the catfish, which seem to like them very well. The whole system is ran off of a 560 gallon per hour pump. 
which does that's more than enough pump. This is the mud pot. Catfish hiding down there. You know the catfish hiding in there. Got a piece of rebar or angle iron, I mean. So rust will accumulate in the system. My auto tracking is just in. My auto tracking is up here. See it. That's my belt siphon. It works very well since it's been going. Inside of it. All I have in here is a mixture of lava rock because it's lighter and river rock so the seeds could start better on the surface. This works very well. And that's it.